Hey guys, welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a scroll in Blender, a simple kind of low poly scroll in Blender 3.4. But um, thank you for this, all of this love you have shown me throughout these videos and if subscribing means so much to me. So if you could subscribe, that would be in the mean of a lot. Yeah, comment down below what I should make next and let's hop into the video. So to start off, we're going to do Shift A, add in a circle. And what you want to do to that is um we just want to go into that upper view that this view the upper kind of view so we can view it from a side on angle go into tab and then you want to drag and select these bottom right vertices like so and you just want to delete them so right click and then delete vertices and you just want to delete those bottom half vertices and then yeah that's it and then click on one of these vertices at the end and then press E to extrude like so and just E to extrude again, E to extrude again and just go in a spiral kind of um, pattern because that's what we'll need to make a scroll but um, yeah, and just follow what I'm doing right now just a little circular pattern and you can distance these, distance these uh, vertices out more if you would like but I just uh, made them quite close so there's more detail I guess in the little circular motion but yeah that is should be it for the circular end of it and now now go out of tab mode press a like so and then e to extrude upwards you can slow it down if it is too fast and e to extrude upwards like so and that go into tab mode and then control r scroll your mouse wheel and then stop until it gets to two and then left click left click and then you just press s to scale inwards and then that's it that's the basic kind of scroll shape and now rotate that 90 degrees like so so it's just tilted like so and then what you want to do to that is uh yeah you can do that and then you can um yeah that's it really for that bit area of the scroll now what you want to do is tab mode select all and then going to extrude and then going to extrude along normals so this will just widen this whole scroll and make it all a much bigger i guess yeah like so so that will just make it um more authentic i don't know but yeah that gives it a more beefier kind of look but after that what you want to do is shift a add in a cylinder and then what you want to do is rotate that to 90 degrees as well like so and then s to scale and then just uh, size that down like so scale that down a little bit like so so we can just have a more realistic feel and then you can just right click and then shade smooth and then right click on that and shade smooth as well like so and that is the general kind of shape and now we want to do shift a add in a circle change the vertices to 12 or 25 or something then a g and then z and then you want to Go on to side view, rotate that, R to rotate, S to scale, you can slow it down, and then uh, S to scale, G to move, and then we're just going to fix it onto that area, and then we're going to tab, E to extrude, press A, and then F to fill in all the little holes and stuff, so it gives it a plain kind of look, like so. Now you want to do shift A, add in a um, plane, and then you want to just scale that, like so. And then you want to select those two vertices and then G and then Z to move upwards. And then you want to do Control R, scroll your mouse wheel and just kind of uh, extrude it and use the G tool to uh, move it like so. And then Control R and then move that inwards like so. And that is the basic kind of shape of the scroll. And that is all the scroll bits done. You just want to extrude that a little bit outwards and then just fix it onto the thing. Uh, just play around with it to be honest it doesn't have to be perfect but yeah you want to make sure it's uh, all connected so we have to uh, kind of uh, connect it like so but yeah that is the general shape and now for coloring now for coloring what we need to do is we're going to add color ramps so you can follow what i do or you can make your own colors it's really up to you but it doesn't really matter so let's get into it <laughs> 